Pixie, thanks so much for joining us. Thank you so much. <laughs> and of course, we are talking about the Summer Guide. Now, for those who may or may not be familiar, what exactly is the Summer Guide and what can they find in it? Sure, this guide is this year for this summer. It's our first 40 page guide ever. It's normally 32, but we have just grown and grown and grown so that for this summer guide, we have 40 pages chock full of fun. Uh, we do guides three times a year. It's not just Parks and Rec, it's our libraries, museums, uh, also uh, civic services, mm -hmm. those types of things. We also have information on uh, the health department and animal services. So it really is a comprehensive guide for anyone to have all summer long. So if people are looking for when uh, swimming pools are going to be open and things like that, will they find that information in the summer guide? That's right. All of that information is in there. We've got swimming lessons again this year, so that information is in there and how to register. Very, very good. What about uh, workout? I was going to say, you got workout stuff in there. I love that this guide is May through September. It's yeah. not a short period of time. You guys are making sure we're summer. equipped for I the know. entire summer That's and a start a fall. sometimes, it I will is. tell you. But our staff does a tremendous job in lining these things out so that we can provide it to the public in a timely manner. And we do have our fitness in the plaza this year. I'm excited because we have expanded it to Zumba for the month of May, but then we'll have Pilates and Tai Chi in June, and then of course, in August and July, July and August, we have yoga in the plaza again. So we're excited Very about nice. that. That's free. You can work out every Saturday all summer long. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Nancy. Thank you. We yes, we really it. appreciate it. And of course, that was a glance at our local happenings. Now let's get to those local headlines.